Greetings, Earthman from Origami's Living Soil. Hoping that God is blessing you on this fine day. Um, today we're going to talk about indigenous microorganisms and making your own IMO1 and then IMO2. Um, so basically what I have in this uh, bin is... Um, a different amount of soil from places I've traveled um, from you know the Northeast of the United States um, <clears throat> like Virginia and Vermont and uh, Maine and uh, here in New York and you know just a bunch of places in woods next to trees that had some nice soft um, soil um, maybe some fungus growing around it um, uh, leaf piles uh, that were like really um, uh, highly f uh, concentrated with a lot of microbes um, worm cast different uh, worm castings I've picked up here and there and uh, and I threw in, uh, in my, my own bacteria too um, from uh, around this area and um, and there's some lactic bacteria in there and photosynthetic bacteria and there's a whole bunch of different uh, bacteria living in, in this um, soil here. And so so what you do is, you, that's what you do. You collect soil from around uh, your neck of the woods, put some earthworm castings, other um, sources of bacteria and fungi into a bin. And then you take some white rice and you cook it. Um, some people cook it al dente, but I cook it done, kind of soft. And um, then I uh, let it cool and dry off and um, dry out and then I, I I'm gonna put it inside here like this and then I'm gonna bring it downstairs and I'm gonna cover it with a lid a loose lid i um, not gonna you know smother it and um, I'm gonna let the, uh, let the bacteria just uh, feast upon that rice the carb carbohydrates in that rice and what's gonna happen is um, a whole bunch of uh, uh, bacteria are uh, gonna be like a spider web uh, is gonna be across that and uh, as soon as it's done, you're going to take uh, brown sugar um, and you're going to mix it with the equal amounts of rice that you got here, which is here about two cups. So I'm going to mix that in a couple cups of rice once it's ready. And that's your IMO2. IMO1 would be the rice with the bacteria um, um, uh, webbing, I guess you could say what it looks like, mycelium. Uh, and then you know and so you mix that with the brown sugar and then it, that stuff is good to go for up to a year it can last for a year and what you do with that is you you take small amounts and you uh, put it in a bucket with some water and a little bit more molasses and um, and then you bubble it with air stones from like a fish tank for a while like you know 18 hours or so and uh, that'll just uh, increase the population of the bacteria you put in that water because of the uh, you know the oxygen and uh, the uh, the carbohydrates from the sugar and um, uh, the mean the molasses and so um, and then that you use to treat your compost or your soil or your leaf pile whatever you you want to uh, put your uh, put uh, you know this huge bacteria population and fungi population and so. Um, there you go. There's IMO1, and then you'll see IMO2 uh, next video. So may God bless you, and if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them. And if you like the video, go ahead and hit like. If you haven't subscribed to me, uh, I would advise you to subscribe. I got a lot more uh, information coming at you. And, um, you know, this is all from God to you. You know, from, you know he gives it to me, and... Um, and I give it to you and you know and you know well of course there's lots of other videos that are uh, that teach how to do this on on YouTube this is just one of many so may God bless you and your family this day